My name's Hazard. Matt Hazard. At one time, I was one of the most popular action game characters in the business. I started off like a lot of guys, side-scrolling my way through the 80s, an 8-bit sprite with more firepower than pixels. When the 90s came along, I signed on with Marathon Software to star in their original first-person shooter. Matt Hazard 3D went straight to the top of the charts. It was the first in a string of hits as long as my... Well, let's just say it was long. Really, really long. Marathon signed me to a lifetime gig, and I branched off into every action niche imaginable. Spy thrillers, survival horror games, fantasy adventures, and even a fun series of buddy cop games with a rookie sidekick named Dexter Dare. I guess all that success went to my head. I asked Marathon if I could take the Mad Hazard brand in new directions, and they let me run with it. Let's just say that was a mistake. That debacle sent the company into a tailspin. The place went downhill faster than you can say non-violent water gun based third person shooter. Don't ask. I thought that was the end. Until a new CEO came along and bought the place. Now the company's called Marathon Megasoft, and the new guy insisted that I'd be the star in their first next-gen shooter. So here I am, back in the game. This time around, I'm a no-nonsense detective who plays by his own rules, ready to embark on a new adventure that will take me to all kinds of exotic locales, starting with a Japanese steakhouse? Nah, what the hell, you gotta start somewhere. We finally got a break in the soon case. Somebody was running a protection racket out of the swankiest Japanese restaurant in Chinatown, and an informant told us that the drop was going to take place tonight. I have to get in there and get the money back to the shop owners in the neighborhood, and I'm going to rain hell on whoever gets in my way. Great. An in-game tutorial. God, I hate these things. I think that after 20 years in the industry, I know how to fire a damn gun. A cover tutorial, too, is if I don't know how to hide behind something. Man, there's a lot of text in this game. Sure hope you can read. Okay, what now? Okay, I have to admit the downrange cover thing is pretty cool. Sure would be nice if I could jump. I don't know how I managed to survive. All these years without a tutorial, and now they're teaching me how to punch a guy's lights out. Jeez.
I will take the right side. was one.
I am the man. The fuzz. The fuzz? Now there's something you don't hear every day. Who might you be? The name's Sonny Tang. That's Sonny as in Sonny. Your ass is gonna get kicked. And Tang as in what? Tang! So, it's pretty obvious you're not the brains of the operation. Who's in charge? You don't come around here flapping your gums and asking questions. You best be on your way before I make me some pig sushi. I'm sorry. <clears throat> Did I miss something in the script? Is this game set in 1972? Keep talking, Hazard. You got about 10 seconds before I go upside your head, Kung Fu style. Okay. How about we skip that and you just tell me where the money is? I ain't telling you squat. That money belongs to Mr. Chang, fair and square. He got it for community service work, if you get my drift. Look, I'm gonna give you one more chance. Get the hell out of my way and let me settle this with your boss. No way, pig. You want to confab with the boss, man? You gotta get through me first. Son of a... For that, 
Wax on, Mother Humper! Thursday. Definitely validates my coolness.
What the? Who the hell are you? Your worst nightmare! Except in the daytime when you are not asleep. Oh yeah? Well, you better... What? Your life will now end. Prepare to begin your death. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't mean to laugh, but whoever's writing your material needs to lay off the 80s action flicks. Your words are puny, like you. You are the past, Matt Hazard. I am the future, and your present ends now! <laughs> What the heck is going on here? Matt, can you hear me? Yeah, I hear you. Where are you? No time to explain right now. Someone is bound to notice I've hacked in and paused the game. You've got a problem, and I'm here to help. Problem? What problem? Your saves have been erased. If that bullet had hit you, you would have been dead. Permanently. What are you talking about? Look, we're out of time. They took your weapons when you walked in here, so you're going to have to use your melee subroutines to fight this guy. I can do a little something to even the odds. Just a damn minute. I want to know what's going on here. No time. Just take this guy out. We'll talk when you're done. <laughs> That's a hell of a thing. Okay, lady, whoever you are, we need to talk now. I couldn't agree more. Hi, Matt. Still in one piece, I see. <laughs> yeah, thanks. And you are? I can't tell you my name. I think we're safe in this part of the server, but you can never be sure. Just call me QA. Uh, okay, QA. Mind telling me what's going on? I hacked into this game I found running on a secure server, and that's when I noticed you were in trouble. That guy you just KO'd was Sting Sniperscope. He's referenced in the code for every level of the game. But you? You're only in level one. Look, babe, there's gotta be some mistake. I'm the star of this game. No, you're not. The code shows that there was going to be a plot twist that took you out as the player character and put Sniperscope in your place. And don't call me babe. Well, if I'm still alive and he's dead, game over, right? Unfortunately, no. The game is still running, and I need time to find out what's going on. How do you keep the game running if the main character slash star is dead? That's where you come in. Without weapons and saves? I don't think so. I've already restored the save feature. And as for weapons... Oh yeah, much better. Suits make me look kinda old. But... Won't somebody notice that I'm not Sniper Scout? If you stick to the objectives, it will be a while before anyone sees the switch. I'll keep an eye on you. I might even be able to hack in a surprise or two from time to time to help you out. Then I guess... It's hazard time. Um... Yeah... outside the main level so you can get your bearings before the heavy stuff starts. Thanks, babe. I owe you one. Great. You can start by not calling me babe. Now, move your ass. The level's starting. Okay. Uh, right. And, okay, I, honestly, if we could just, like, summarize it. Sorry. Here, try this. Yeah, that's more like it. What are you doing here? Oh, 
awesome. What was that, QA? I saw it before in level one. That was a code glitch. Somebody is hacking the game code, changing something in the level. And it's not me. What the high noon is going on here? Son of a... If I didn't know any better, I'd say that was Jebediah Bedlam. He's the leader of that gang of bandits I fought in a fistful of hazard. Somebody on the outside must have uploaded him into the game. Well, why would they bother hacking in a stagecoach bandit when the place is already crawling with modern enemies? better than that. What's up with the dancers? They're animatronic bots used to conserve memory. Whoever designed the level never expected characters to get down to the dance floor. That's what you get for attacking me.
this hurts me. Bless you, go! Okay, QA. I made it to the manager's office. What now? Kitty. Kitty Abundanza. Matt Azard. What the hell are you doing shooting up my casino? I had no idea it was your place. What are you doing here anyway? Trying to revive my career, which went straight to hell when we split up. You cheated on me, and everyone hated me for breaking up with you. Now get the hell out of here before I stop kicking and start shooting. Kitty, I'm here because something crazy's going on. It's hard to explain, but... Ah, oh, hell. Here we go again. Matt, somebody just uploaded a massive number of enemies, and they're heading your way. Those look like... They're the Russian rebels you fought in Tandarai. See what I mean? QA, can you hack us and exit? It'll take a while. You'll have to stop. You stay here, Kitty. The hell I will.
I'm right behind you. Matt, wait. You can't leave. You have to finish the level. Okay, fine. But I guess we all know what that means. It's hazard time. You know, it's already getting kind of old. What are you talking about? <sighs> Never mind. Just go. I just hacked in another upgrade for you. When an upgrade is on, it enhances the effects of whatever weapon you use. There's something different about this area. It's not on the map. Somebody must have hacked it in to give the Russians access to the nightclub.
Andrei! Svadvoj! Kolja! Privjej! Stodinirjejš! General Neutronov! Yes, Matt Hazard. It is I. Your pathetic attempts to stop my plans for Soviet domination of the world will come to nothing! <laughs> Man, I tell you, this is just nuts. This is new. I have once again proven Soviet superiority by managing to smuggle nuclear device into country right under your hoses. Noses. General, this isn't what it seems. You're making a mistake. If you think you can talk me out of this, it is you who is mistaken. You will never be able to kill me and disarm the bomb in time, Hazard. The power of the Soviet Union reigns supreme!
Whew, that was close. Matt, the Russians weren't after you. They were gunning for Kitty. And she's not the only marathon hero that's in trouble. The next level is loading now. And it looks like they're about to ambush Bill Schindler. Bill the Wizard? From Overlords of Wizard World? Nah, he'll be fine. He's what, level 75 by now? He can kick anybody's butt. No, he can only access a few spells outside of his game. He won't survive long without help. Then you have to get me in there, fast. was close. That was close. Came from up here. Feral creatures coming in from the right. It's not like Bill has any That was close. You need to stop those attacks. Lightning bolt! This is beginning to look grim. None shall pass! 